Hey guys, welcome to Thursday. Two for Thursday, two for Tuesday, I think it was. Back in the day, don't miss those days. Glorious, <laughs> my body couldn't handle it right now. But uh, I want to talk to y'all a little bit tonight about the plumb line. What plumb line do you ask? Well, God's plumb line for our life because if this plumb line is in place and being followed, it really brings everything else into place. And uh, it's so simple that uh, we miss it, or we get it, and then we let it go. And that simple plumb line is this. And Jesus put it this way. Love the Lord God with all your heart, your mind, your soul, your strength. May the Lord with all your being. Now, what I found is if I'm not receiving God's love for me, it's really hard for me to love Him and even harder for me to love others. But I got really challenged today by this. I was sitting here painting this room quiet and just was like ooh, bawling as I heard this message. And I just want to encourage you tonight. As I often do in these videos, just about receiving God's love and serving him in that love. You know, it's the true plumb line. If that's out of whack, everything else will be out of whack. We'll try to fill it. We'll try to substitute it. But if we're not receiving God's love, if we're not flowing out in that love, we're never truly going to be satisfied, content, fulfilled in our lives. And it's not like God had any lack that he's saying, okay, well, I need them to love me. God was fulfilled in his relationship with the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. But love, it's dynamic. It has to expand. It has to give. And he could have called us into anything. But the creator of our lives, of the world, of the universe said, I want you to love. I want you to walk in love. I want you to receive my love as your father. And then I want you to give that away. And there can be seasons in life. I know some of the toughest things that we walk through is when that, when that we feel like it's <laughs> constipated. We're not being able to release that. But you know, as we receive it, and what love for us, sometimes my, my language is, hey, just make it easy. Make it convenient. Make it, um, you know, where I feel good about everything and this and that, this and that. But sometimes that's not always the path of love for our lives. So I want to encourage you tonight. Let the plumb line come down. Because that plumb line, it'll put things in right order. It'll be things in the right place. You know, the fear of the Lord, to worship Him, to love Him, to obey Him, brings harmony to all things in time. So, that's my encouragement to you. Heading out to play some volleyball. God loves you. Loves me. Forget about back here. Don't be worried about way up here. Live today. Prepare. Position yourself. And believe He really does love you.